Now this is my version of the Unibox and the one thing that I improved upon I think is that, I, that uh, I've disguised the pin along the brake line of the lid here and uh, I've got four of them so you really don't know which one needs to be pulled uh, if you know that at all I guess that's kind of the secret of this box but uh, when you show it to your friends or family whatever but it's a nice little project if you're interested in building one I have a set of plans um, this is you know it's really quite simple it's just box joints but um, to get all three sides to or all four five sides to go together and then to get the lid to fit nicely it does take a little bit of work and um, that, that that was the challenging part of building this little box so it's a good exercise in in um, in joinery and patience too I guess so you're you're kind of wondering which pin is it that 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 needs to be pulled you know it doesn't come out you can't shake it out because it's held in place but it has to be pulled with a magnet and I keep that on top of the pivot point here and you can see here that these these do not get do not come out but that one does so that's the secret pin pivot that lid pull this one back and now you have access to the inside of the box and the reason that this pin does not come out is because I've got another rare earth magnet here super glued to the sidewall and it's got enough power through that thin wall there to hold that pin in place so that worked out really really nicely I thought so then you lock this one in place with the dovetail spin this one closed put your pin back in and now it's locked back up so if you're interested I have a set of plans um, if you just want to kind of wing it from here why that's my version so thanks for watching and if you want to see how I built it uh, stay tuned